guys, it's Heather from Calva Plan. I apologize about my raspy voice. I'm getting over being sick. But today I wanted to share with y'all the new Digital Detox Companion Pack from the Happy Planner. I picked this up at my local Joann's. It's starting to roll out now. Um, it's also available on the Happy Planner website. And this comes with all of this stuff inside. So we're going to flip through it and then I'm going to show you guys some ways that I plan on using this Digital Detox Pack. So let's open it up. All of the companion packs come with one of these bracelets to remind you of your focus. So this says, as a reminder to focus on your relationships with yourself and those important to you. So I'm gonna stick that up there. Um, more music, more tea, more books, more laughter, more smiles, more walks, more road trips, more love, more creating, more dreaming. So then you open it up and it has all of the goodies inside. So let's start over here on the left side. On the left side we have this card that says unplug and breathe. We have some unplug stickers, unplug today, don't waste your precious life online, and just some stickers to remind you to disconnect. Then we have some dividers. Almost everything will work again if you unplug it for a, for, for a few minutes, including you, and then your focus word, and then your digital detox bucket list. And these are thicker, so they're kind of like a divider, but without a tab. Oh, and we also have a clear pocket page for you to create some stuff in as well. So I already have some ideas floating around on how to use that. Now, these pages over here are like the main reason I was super excited about this companion pack. So we have doodles and a wish list, draw a pretty flower. And they, these are thicker so that they'll like, they're more durable. What the best day ever looks like, funniest thing I've heard. Doodles, your favorite person. My greatest accomplishments. And then we have a bunch of blank notebook paper. It's totally blank except for the border which means you can doodle, you can draw, you can do all kinds of stuff on that paper. These were the pages I was like most excited about, these reading list pages. There's only two, so I'm actually thinking about making copies of this before drawing on it and coloring it in because I love it so much. But this is what I'm gonna use for my 2020 reading list. Okay, <clears throat> we have a digital detox bucket list. Unplug every day. So, these are things that you can do instead of being online. Um, I'm super excited to try those out as well. Unplug this week. You've totally got this. Write out some achievable goals you can accomplish in a week and specific actions to make them happen. Those are really cute. So, you get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You get 10 of those. So reminders to unplug. And then we have paper that says unplug today. And it's really pretty and purple. So I'm going to be showing you guys how I plan on using some of these pages. So let's get started. Okay, so I have my laminator over here heating up. And because this pack only came with two of these and 10 of these, I want to use these on a regular basis because I really want to make detoxing and unplugging like a digital detox part of my routine in 2020 and I know that 10 weeks of it I need more than that and so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to actually laminate these two pages so that I can then use a wet erase marker and use them over and over and over and over and over again so I'm heating up my laminator and once it's heated up we will laminate but before we laminate what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut off the edge because um, when you laminate it, you won't be able to like re-punch exactly where these holes are. You're going to basically punch a different part, the laminated part. So I'm just going to cut off the punched part.
And then I will repunch it once it's been laminated. Oh, there's back stuff on the back too. Okay, and then I'm going to pull two laminating pouches because I don't oh they might both actually fit if I were to trim them Still a little bit too tall. I was trying to see. I don't think they would both fit widthwise anyway. All right, so lay this in there, and then you just run it through your laminator. And once it's run through, you can use a wet erase marker. Um, I don't know if I have any right here. I'll have to find them. I think they're on my other desk. Um. <coughs> but yeah, then you could punch it and you reuse it over and over and over again in your planner. So I ran these through the laminator and then because I just used three mil lamination, then my Happy Planner Punch worked on it. If you use a laminate that's bigger than three mil, then your Happy Planner Punch won't punch it. Um, and so now, <coughs> I could take my planner and go to my extra sheets. And here I have a laminated page that I made and another laminated page. So I'm just gonna add I actually don't think I want these in my extra pages section though, because I want to actually use them. So I'm gonna put them towards the front where I will we'll see them. And like this can be for the whole month. These are things that I'm gonna do and I can check them off as I do them. And then this will be for each week. And they're eliminated so then I can just wipe them off and use them again at the end of the week. So I love how that turned out. Um, if you like this video, I hope you hit the like button. If you want to see more of my videos, hit the subscribe button. And happy planning.